What's up, YouTubers? Jellatom7 here. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button because I upload videos in Arcane. I'm here to update you guys on what's going on with the cyber bullying, as I'm calling it, scandal with, um, it's kind of, it's sort of a scandal, it, it might not be, with, um, Camel's Crew, the KCB boys. I mean, as, as the, the cops in GT Online say, this shit ends right now. It needs to end right now. I'm sick and tired of going onto my YouTube and seeing comments that say, like, uh, I, this guy commented, stop uploading videos, KCB, whatever, that's like whatever they're, all their names are. He said, you need to stop uploading videos, you get like no views on them. It's like, so what? I just do YouTube for fun, you know? You can't have a hobby. My hobby just happens to be YouTube. And that's fine. If, And then I commented on his comment. Don't you have anything better to do than watch my videos and comment rude and hateful things towards me? And then he commented, No, because I like annoying your, your fat fuck, fuck ass. I'm like, wow. Wow. They have a YouTube. I'm subscribed to it. You don't see me going on their channel and commenting 50 million things about why their channel sucks. It just, it doesn't, it wouldn't make any sense. And you need to keep what I might think, what I think is, you need to keep what's in GTA, in GTA, on GTA chat. What's real life, like YouTube and, and stuff, you need to leave on YouTube. That you shouldn't mix them together because shit gets weird. And you need to leave stuff that's in the game, in the game. And that means... If someone is trash talking you on GT Online, you just leave the goddamn session. You don't sit in there and let them do what they did to me. Cause that shit ain't right at all. And this goes for anyone that's thinking about joining KCB. If you want to join a street crew go, crew, go ahead. But if you don't like trash talking people's YouTube like they like to do, don't join their crew. My their they their leader keeps comparing my crew to um, their crew, and that's like comparing a smart car to a Lamborghini. My crew is obviously like the, um, the smart car, and theirs is like the Lamborghini. My crew is, well actually, let me think about that, actually it's the other way around. And you might think, well why a smart car? Well maybe because the smart car is all about, biz is all about saving money and staying on track. The Lamborghini's all about, oh yeah, I'm gonna drive a, a sports, a supercar, on the street, have fun, it, you know, it's all mess around. My crew is like the, the Lamborghini. We're all mess around, it's all about helping people out when they need it, when they're in a public lobby, and it's just about having fun and with, hanging out with people, meeting new people, and, and going and, um, finding new, um, new friends and it's also about getting special or like unique crew colors like this scroller I got now if you like it feel free to join my crew I'll leave a link up in the description another thing is I blocked the one guy so I blocked him on kick because they were making fat jokes about me and spamming up my phone so I blocked like three of them and I'm starting to think I don't know who's which side camel is on I mean if he's on their side or not I was in their crew and they kicked me because I wasn't real serious about the whole street crew thing and you guys have seen what happened pretty much and what see what I don't get is this was like at least like three or four weeks ago you would think they could get their shit together and move on but you know what it's obvious for them because they like making fun of people and I did actually break down and cry in one of my videos. I will admit that. We're all human. We have emotions. If we didn't have emotions, then what, what does that make you? Some kind of institute synth from Fallout 4? I don't know. But we're human. You live, laugh, love, learn, and forget stuff in life and learn. It's part of life. You, you take risks every day, and the risks might be good or bad. Like the protagonist says in Fallout 4, I didn't find myself in this world, it found me.
thank you guys for tuning in to this GT Online video. I'll catch you in the next one.